Welcome to my kitchen. Healthy eating starts in your own home. When I go to clients' houses, one of the first things I like to do is open up the refrigerator because that's gonna give you a good idea of how they're eating. But also like to look in the pantry. There are a lot of great pantry items that you can have around to put together a quick meal as an adjunct to your diet. So here I have some dried mushrooms. I have some bulgur wheat that makes a great quick salad. It only takes about 20 minutes to boil. I have some ground flaxseed. It's really great to throw into smoothies. It adds omega-3 fatty acids to the diet and fiber. And then here I have some walnuts, also another great source of fatty acids. And in fact, I'm gonna show you how to make cocoa truffles. And these are items I just happen to have around in my pantry, all in dry storage. So here I have some medjool dates. These are a great source of fiber, great source of potassium. And what makes them unique as far as fruits, they're a great source of iron too. Now you wanna make sure that they're pitted. So if you just open it up like this, you'll see there's a pit inside. So I have one cup of medjool dates I'm gonna put into my food processor, half a cup of unsweetened dark chocolate cocoa powder. So you wanna make sure it's unsweetened. This also has anti-inflammatory properties. It naturally lowers blood pressure. I'm gonna put a little bit of sea salt in. I know it sounds counterintuitive that something sweet should have salt in it, but it actually brings out the sweetness. So just a little sprinkle. And then I have some good vanilla here. This is a bourbon flavored vanilla. So this is really gonna be the base of our recipe. I'm gonna put just a little bit of water in there. Now how much water you put in is really gonna depend on how dry the dates are. So we'll put in maybe a couple tablespoons to start. Okay, and then I'm just gonna give this a quick process. Okay, and that looks just about how we want it. It's a little crumbly, but it sticks together. Think like Play-Doh. I'm gonna put a little bit of cinnamon in. Cinnamon is very good for controlling blood sugar. I'm gonna put a little bit of cayenne pepper to it, so we're giving it sort of a southwestern flair. Okay, and then we're gonna roll this into balls maybe a little smaller than a ping pong. And then I'm gonna to top it off with a little extra cocoa powder. You won't believe how delicious and fudgy these are. So here we have our finished cocoa truffles. And this is my friend, Lauren. Hi. So Lauren is an elite athlete and Lauren was looking for some ways to fuel her body before and after her workouts. So I invited her over to try our cocoa, cocoa truffles. So if you remember, we used um, just dates as the base. So we didn't put any sugar in these at all. We put a little bit of bourbon flavored vanilla, some sea salt, and then we spiced it up with that little bit of cayenne, a little cinnamon, and then we have that nice cocoa powder so you get that rich chocolatey taste. We can definitely taste the cayenne and it's definitely sweet. So it's perfect for a pre post workout snack. Um, I'd definitely be interested in trying these out. Okay, well then we'll have to make another batch. Sounds good.